Hey guys, welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about a Roblox ban issue, the truth behind it, because people are believing this and people are thinking that FPS unlockers will get your account banned. People are thinking that using executables will get your account banned. All this buy phone stuff that's happening, you're getting your account deleted, whatever. In today's video, I'm going to debunk that. And, um,. Yeah, let's get started. So recently I have found a tweet from an account and on Twitter and they have basically, this is the source of this entire ban. And I'll let the other clip that I made show and speak on it so you guys can get a better understanding of it. So we all know the screenshot. The screenshot basically says, Using and distributing third-party software in order to change, manipulate, or gain unauthorized access to Roblox's game client and its content is strictly prohibited. And you can see that there's three banned notes for misusing Roblox's systems and cheating. One of it is FPS Unlocker, and the other is a Roblox executable and someone cheating in a Roblox game. This specific ban note is false and it's fake because the original poster of this one which is cool roblox bands they posted it the same day so this is clearly from them it's sourced out from them and they have just made a tweet not too long ago basically stating that it is fake it's all made up and you will not get banned for using fps unlockers which roblox also confirmed that and by far anti cheat hasn't shown any kind of actions or anything on anybody as of right now so yeah this is all fake so if you believe this then that's you, you now know that it's fake and this also goes with this specific screenshot as well with the same reason for the same thing this person is looking for clout um because this band note does not exist it is all fake and false and no it's not made by cool box bands it's posted by, by corpse uh, which said Grave just told them that they got banned for this reason, which they posted this as well. So Grave is clearly attention seeking at this point because this entire band note, entire reasoning is all false. It's all fake. It's all made up from the start and they just copied the fake one. So people are spreading fake band notes all around. So beware if you see any band notes of using or distributing third party software or whatever right now, currently. That is all fake and it's all fraud, it's not real because Roblox has not publicly announced it and there, it's not in any type of Roblox's systems, it's just made to believe that it is. So I guess script kitties or whatever would be terrified but FPS Unlocker got hit in the mix and that kind of caused this whole drama. So yeah, this whole thing is fake, this whole bad note is fake, don't believe it, don't trust it. As of right now, you won't get banned for using FPS unlockers or any type of third-party software as far as what I know. And um, yeah, just stay safe out there. And yeah, now that you have seen that entire clip, now you know how that ban note is fake. And it's all made up. It is not real at all. People just took it out of context and didn't really source it. So they just saw it, screenshotted it, or saved it to their device, and they just sent it on, passed it on, and now people believed that their account is gonna get banned, but obviously not a lot of people showed this exact reason. Even a lot of exploits or people that do hack on Roblox, they, they've never said anything about this. And as far as what I know, Bifron, it's slowly rolling out and nothing really has been shown to the public yet what it's doing or if you're gonna get banned from it. So just as a precaution, just if you're hacking, don't hack at all, Re really, like while you're hacking in the first place. And for FPS unlockers, just, you can use them, it's safe, it's fine. Roblox won't ban you for it as long as the FPS unlocker that you're using is is strictly just for unlocking the FPS and not anything else. Then they won't classify it as an exploit, an injection, whatever. So just to clarify this, this is the truth behind this ban note and for reasons I cannot disclose how I got this information or 
who I talked to, if I talked to Cool Box fans about this, I would not disclose that because it's all kept anonymous. They've told me to keep it all anonymous, just basically state what it's there in public. So, yeah, that is it, and I'll see you guys later. Stay safe, don't believe it's fake news, it's fake information, and yeah.